Alright, boys, I know it's kind of getting a little excessive at this point, but this is how I have fun with the game. I built a new theme team. Last week, we did 50 out of 50 Raiders. Now, you can probably tell by the thumbnail, we do have 50... 50 Falcons. I know it's becoming one of the most popular ones. They just got a lot of Ring of Honor items. We added basically all of them to the team, man. This theme team is loaded. It's a fun one. A lot of new names, a lot of new cards that we get to try and showcase in today's video, man. But if you guys enjoy videos like this, man, we are pushing for 50k. We're so close. By the time you've probably seen this, we might be 400, 300 subs away. We're getting really close, man. I appreciate all the love and support this year so far. But other than that, let's just jump right into the team build and then some gameplay. If you were looking for cheap, fast Mana Coins to build that God Squad you always wanted, head over to my sponsor, EasyMut, and use code CHU for 5% off your order. The link is in the description. The Falcons, like I said, 50 out of 50. I have basically every single card besides one. There's one card I don't have, and it is Tony G. I actually like Kyle Pitts. I feel like this card is very good. He's 99 speed on my team. He also could juke. He is 6'6". Six six. I mean, I wouldn't be running the token on Tony G anyway, so really, at the end of the day, Kyle Pitts is... Just as good for me. I mean, honestly, it really is. And he saves me coins, so I'll take it. The offensive line, they don't really have much besides Lindstrom, which we do have on the theme team right here. But you can see where we got blessed, right? Brian Finneran, he is a six foot five and 99 speed wide receiver on our team. Eric Dickerson also gets Falcons chem. We're rocking our token on him. And then obviously, big dog Mike Vick, man. These two alone make the theme team so electric. And then you add guys like Finneran and also 99, gold 99, Devin Hester right behind him as well. The offense from these four cards alone makes it so fun to rock. This offense is amazing. The defense is also really, really good. And I will say, this should not be Derek Carr. This is actually supposed to be John Madden. He's supposed to be 90. I think he'd be 99 speed on my team. Six foot four would have great abilities. But right now, I don't have my reward still. Or it's a login reward. I still have not got mine yet. So don't mind Derek Carr. Picture that in your head as 99 speed, six foot four John Madden. I have to use Derek Carr, sadly, but that's only because I already had it from the Raiders team team. But we do got Jesse Bates, and we're okay with spending AP on him and overpaying on him because we are saving AP with guys like Troy Polamalu, Deion Sanders down here. We got the LTD, John Abraham, and then look at the new D'Angelo Hall. So not really too many defensive cards. I mean, Bates is really good. Deion's really good. Obviously, D'Angelo Hall's good. Uh, John Abraham's solid. And we're also going to have a theme team, John Madden, right here. But the offense really carries the theme team. I would say Raiders is probably deeper and better all around. But if you want some new and exciting cards, the Falcons is really good. And it's probably a really good hybrid theme team. 25 Raiders, 25 Falcons, man. I don't know, man. Let's take him into a game. Let's see how good the squad plays. First time ever using all of them at once. Hey, right, boys. This is not my Super Bowl, by the way. So this is his. We got the Falcons jerseys on. I want to know if we get ball first because we do have that brand new Devin Hester. Obviously, we have him. But he has some of the best return abilities in the game. He has return man for zero, energizer for zero. And there he is, man. Come on, man. Let's go get a return with him. Starting a video off with the return with our brand new 99 Hester would be electric. But as you guys could see... Wow, man, he scum kicked to our fullback right there. What happens to be Dickerson, but ah, that's tough. Some 6-1 action, boys. It looks like if you could, we already know what exactly what it is now. Pulling that guy over just basically told me what he's running. He is sending the entire crib, boys. Yep, exactly what it's going to be right there. And look at our guy, Hester, dominating already. Oh, we got the bad juke animation, man. We got the bad juke. I honestly have been playing so many people that play this way lately. I don't know what it is. I swear everybody just runs this, and it looks like our only non-Falcon is going to have a wide open touchdown, man. I don't want to score with him, but this guy is running a cover zero. Come on, man. I got to take advantage. That's the freest touchdown of my life. Also, I forgot to show it. I did forget to show this as well. Matt Prater is a 98 overall kicker. And he's also, like, the best kicker or tied for the best kicker in the game. He's also a Falcon. He gets Falcons theme team. That's a big deal, boys. I'll take it. Not bad. It seems like everybody literally has Vic right now. And also, you can see a lot of people also do have that Dickerson out there. I really wish we had, like, our, our actual team right now. Uh, some people have John Madden. I, for, for some reason, am one of the people who got cheated and still don't have him. It is unfortunate, but you guys can see this guy probably going to be running the ball a lot, and he has Dickerson. He's going to have that X Factor on later. Come on, man. We got to be better. We got it. All right. That was a terrible stick. He's going to get yards on that play. That was just embarrassing. All right. That's my fault. I didn't think he was going to continue to run the exact same play, but he's doing it. All right. All right. This is getting out of hand, man. He's just running and just duking randomly. Come on, team. Let's just watch my Aaron Donald and Sap get juked out of their shoes on a cutback from a running back. That would have been a destroy shot in real life. You know what I mean? I'm going to be honest, boys. I don't know what he's running, but did you see all our DBs? I did not guess run right there. All of our DBs were blitzing. 
so far. He's running the play action, though. We're ready, boys. Come on. We're ready. He's just throwing some random stuff. That's how you choke a good drive right there. Come on. Bend, but don't break defense. That's exactly what I love to see right there, man. Now we can control the game. We have Eric Dickerson. We have Mike Vick. Let's go ahead and make some plays. Uh-oh. Yeah, let's... Am I running the ball without an X-Factor? What kind of nonsense am I on? Running the ball in Madden 24 without an X-Factor is like... It's 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 pure... Like, you're just trying to lose the game. That's literally what it is right there. I can't even say that because he has 40 yards running on us with like three attempts with his Dickerson. No light up yet, but... I don't know. We'll come back to it later in the game. Let's see if we can bounce back real quick. We got Dickerson in the flats, man. Make some plays. Dude, I'm telling you, his juke gets way more horizontal than Bo Jackson's. And you can see we have not lost any stamina yet because Energizer is broken. I need to cook, man. I need to cook. Our offense, I mean, we've had a good game so far on offense, but we're looking for bigger plays. We almost had a really bad throw right there. Come on, Moss. Bail us out a little bit. I'm going for the bomb. We're looking for Hester, or maybe our guy Finneran can break open. Just give me a little bit of time, and uh-oh, Hester, maybe? This is kind of a... Actually, I'm really happy we got tackled right there. That was a risky ball. That was not... There's no way that was getting completed. Absolutely no way. We kind of are starting to struggle a little bit more here. We are actually getting closer to our Eric Dickerson being activated, and I don't know what it is, because I know, like, when a big car... Like, we had a patch, I think it was like Wednesday or Tuesday, but I swear my audibles take like two times sometimes to like motion people over, back people up on defense. I don't know what's been going on lately, but there's the most underrated card on the theme team. Still one of the best tight ends in the game. Genki Force, Kyle Pitts. All right, man. All right, all right, all right. Let's keep on moving the ball real quick. Let's see. Oh, yeah. This is exactly what we want right here, boys. Michael Vick. Oh, this is the best. This is why we use Mike Vick in... I want to die for it, but I got sucked into the animation way too early. That would have been so cool. I think this is a good idea. So you guys know I always do the jet sweep journal. It's probably better to have a taller player there. All right, dude. He came out in full. Okay. All right. All right. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't have a play right now. I could probably audible out of something real quick, but I don't know. Full. I mean, field goal block. You're in your Super Bowl, man. What are you trolling for? This ain't my Super Bowl. And I have some really bad news, boys. His Devin Hester broke a tackle. And went all the way. Uh, exactly what I wanted for my squad just happened for his. I, like I said, I don't really pay attention normally on kickoffs, but maybe I have to start now because Seven Hester is definitely a menace in the game. All right, maybe we can do the same back. He actually gave us a chance this time. I don't know. This is not looking good. I mean, look at literally just look at our chances right there, boys. Oh, what he did on his. Maybe I shouldn't kick it straight, but this is what he did with his. He held it straight. Literally did nothing. Just broke one guy's tackle and boom. No, no juke. No nothing. Just ran straight. Sometimes that's maybe all you need to do, but we can control the clock here. Go with the two possession lead into halftime. Looking good out here. Come on, let's make some plays, boys. He bit again. Uh oh. What am I doing? I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bring this guy back in the game. I'm not doing it. I already know. I'm gonna be the type of guy to juke right there, fumble, and boom, he's right back in the game when we have complete control right now. Instead, what I'm gonna do is target our brand new six foot five, 99 speed receiver, Brian Finneran. Come on, man. Easy play. Dude has like the best D line of all time. JJ Watt, the LTD William Perry, Aaron Donald, and Mean Joe Green that just came out as well. I mean, like, what do we do against this, boys? I mean, JJ Watt, secure tackler, too. I mean, dude, this dude, this is a very good team. This guy arguably has a better team than I do. If you think about it, that D line, Aaron Donald's like a mill. I know JJ Watt's a mill. William Perry, I believe, is still 2.5 right now. That is, that D line alone is insane. Insane, boys. Well, let's see if we can make some plays. We got our, our, I keep trying to say brand new, but it's actually the first time I've used this card. Our guy, Kyle Pitts. Look, man, we are milking the clock. At least end with a two-possession lead going into half, boys. And look who's wide open. Our guy, Finnerin. Oh, God. Tariq Wool at hit stick. Hey, man, let's see if our guy, Finnerin. Maybe we can get a touchdown to the sideline over here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, boys. Finnerin on the sideline. That's exactly... I'm telling you, I didn't think this card was going to be that good. I forget about using him. I used him way earlier in the year. Yeah, he's tough, man. He's definitely a really good card. There's just no way, right? There's absolutely no way. He broke it. This Hester's... Dude, he's a menace. I'm telling you. Now he has a chance. I, I like. I literally kicked it to the left. Uh, dude, it's... I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I... I Actually, I will say, the one thing about me and theme teams is I am very, very, very cheap when it comes to backups. Very cheap. And as you can see, that's probably why we're struggling right there. Got to watch the corner out so we know exactly... Okay, that's not fun to have. We would have had mid zone as well right there on our John Madden if we actually got our card and EA stopped it cheating us. Honestly, we are in a perfect look. I'm telling you guys, there's a new that new patch. I'm telling you, something is wrong in the game. I can't get half of my audibles off. It just literally won't let me. And he was about to throw some. Yeah, that was about to be a dumb ball by the opponent. 
I want to show you guys how long it takes for me to back up quarters. I, I did it right there on the first try because I spammed it. But you can see on the right side, you should be able to do it on the first time. Look, I can't back him up. I literally can't back him up. And now we might get costed because of it. And I don't know what he's... There's no way. In a video, he almost... He almost hit me with the TikTok play. He almost hit me with... The... That would have been crazy. I, I, might have, I would have had to quit and just give him the Super Bowl dub at that point. That would have been... Oh, my. You guys don't know what he... Dude, I'm telling you, I can't audible. I can't back that guy up. So, look. There we go. It, dude, it takes like three times to do it. it. He tried to do a flea flicker on us, and it makes all of your players blitz, so it's basically a free play all around. And there it is, man. A terrible play by the opponent. Turns into a good one. That is just mad at 24 and a nut. All right, man. What does he got for us on second and nine? He hurried up. This is going to be a long game. This is going to be a long game. Fake audibles flipping last second. Uh, it, this is this game is going to take absolutely all day. I already know it is. We're going to go all the way down to one second. Come on. Dude, that was a 30-second play clock. We just waited in real time right there. Come on. John Abraham. John Abraham. Come on, man. I will say I've actually been super impressed with John Abraham so far. So far, he's been amazing. The chat, I, when I was building this theme team on stream yesterday, they were all thinking that he was going to be terrible. And, man, I swear, I, I got to start blitzing this guy or something. He has all day. It's just all broken plays. Hey, the good thing is, though, we have control. We're up seven. We have ball, and we have the best running back in the game with our theme team and also the X Factor active. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, Dickerson. It's going to be easy to chew out games and just win games in general with this card. I can't tell. Yeah, this guy is all out. If anyone ever moves their player like that, you could tell that they're all out blitzing. They make it super obvious. And our guy, Hester, man. Oh, yeah. We're dancing all the way to the crib. Devin Hester. Way too easy. We're about to upset a Super Bowl, man. I'm telling you, the patch ruined it or my game is just absolutely broken. I cannot make audibles. And Aaron Donald, still the best player in the game, in my opinion, on defense. Just insane. Oh, we got it on the first try. We actually were able to back up our Dion right there. Come on, dude. I still can't make all the adjustments I want to make. It is disgusting. I'm telling you, this game got ruined with this last patch. Back up corners immediately. Like, that should never happen, especially with how people can quick snap. It is such a disadvantage to not be able to do so. And he is running a read option. We sniffed it out right away. Uh-oh, boys. Hurrying up on that play. I don't know what he saw right there, but we need something, boys. Please. We have the flats guarded. We have everything we want. We're dropping both corners, blitzing corners into zones right now. Is he going to snap it before the fourth quarter? Uh-oh, here it is. This could be the game right here, boys. And it looks like we're playing good D, but he found a ward. Good play, good play. Can't back up anybody, man. I don't understand it. I don't understand what they did. If you guys go and click any video from like a week ago, gameplay video, theme team video, anything where I'm playing the game, I, you can see I did it on the first try right there. I don't know what it is or what they did to my game, but I literally can't. And look at our... Dude, all the Falcons are going off right now, man. Our guy, D'Angelo Hall, in the slot. Let's go, man. And there it is, boys. We got the dashboard quit. Ruining the Super Bowl with the brand new Falcon C team. What a fun game to do it on as well. I'm not going to lie to you guys. The Falcon C team is very good. And it's a very fun one. Like I said, it's very expensive. I don't know if I would say it's worth switching off the Raiders. Because the Raiders still have the bows. They still have some of the best wide receivers. And they're very deep. And cheaper. I will say that. But the Falcons is new. A lot of new names. D'Angelo Hall, Dickerson, Tony G. Obviously, you got Finner in it, guys. It is really fun to use. Let me know. What do you guys think is the best theme team in the game? Are you guys rocking Falcons or Raiders as well? And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, boys.